Aretha Franklin resurrects an old feud with Dionne Warwick. More than five years ago, Dionne Warwick made a comment at Whitney Houston's funeral, and Aretha Franklin is still not pleased, the Associated Press reported Tuesday. It seems that the legendary singer takes this feud too seriously to rely on anything besides archaic technology to rebut it. Franklin sent a lengthy fax to the A.P. on Monday before calling Tuesday to discuss what she said was a libelous statement that Warwick made in 2012. According to Franklin, Warwick said the following at Houston's funeral. Rees not here, but she is here. She loves Whitney as if she were born to her. She is her godmother. Per the A.P. Franklin said she met Whitney as a child but was far too busy to be anyone's godmother. She said that Warwick blatantly lied on her and knew full well what she was doing. Franklin said she could not attend Houston's funeral because she had swollen feet and was resting so she could perform that night at Radio City Music Hall. She found Warwick's comments about her to be damaging and said she would later address them. The Queen of Soul appears to be doing so now perhaps sparked by a recent interaction with Warwick. Franklin told the A.P. that she saw Warwick last week at a Tribeca Film Festival event honoring Clive Davis, when Warwick approached her. She said, give me a hug. I said, oh, hell no. You couldn't be serious, Franklin said. We've never been friends, and I don't think that Dion has ever liked me. Houston's mother, Sissy Houston, has also spoken out about how Franklin could be confused for her daughter's godmother. She wrote about it in her book Remembering Whitney, My Story of Love, Loss and the Night the Music Stopped, per ABC, using her nickname for Houston, Nippy. Nippy was so impressed with Aretha that she started telling all her friends she was her godmother, and the story stuck because Re never denied it. Eventually, reporters picked it up and everybody assumed it was true. And Nippy never did stop telling people that. A rep for Warwick told Vanity Fair, Dion cannot even dignify a response to Miss Franklin's perplexing and ridiculous statement. Vanity Fair has not yet received comment from a rep for Franklin.